Zaina, and you are watching Milstein Channel. <laughs> For me, at least, it was my first time meeting a lot of people since I was new to the program. So going to the escape room and doing the art high school. It's a nice garden called Worse Than Alcatraz. Wait, who gave it? Demolition. Nia, uh, Master Hacker. Really gave me everyone. Oh, you know, it's bad. Great time uh, in Queens. Today we went 
of the Met and it was a lot of fun. We got to peruse the museum and Erwin gave us a little checklist and way to explore the museum which was really interesting and a totally new way to experience art. Classes are so much fun. We do so much stuff from like 3D printing to making molds and laser cutting. And we've been making a lot this summer and we can't wait for the Milstein Showcase to show all of our work and our creations. We spent one class just talking about what is art. Because what is art? And we went back and forth. Everyone was giving their different opinions about what art can be or what it could be in the is future. Is this art? And that was weird. Is this art? Is attraction art? Is am I art? Hello class. Today I have only one question for you. Is this art? In Bill's class, we have an opportunity to build a computer. So we've been building this computer, we've been learning about open software. Bill's class gives us the opportunity to actually explore these inventions and creations that are right in front of us. Um, I guess this is like really cool. We have a lot of different like materials that we can work with and a lot of different products. It's all how the lab works, learn the different like kind of safety measures. to go to Grand Central Tech um, and Company Ventures for our tech explorations where we get to hear from various uh, speakers um, and it was super interesting at the first time we got to talk to Michael Milstein himself what they do and about Grand Central Tech. So you know if you think about the vision for the program it's really to create this cohort that goes out in the world and does amazing things and like give you a differentiated education and perspective, like, what happens next is important too. Yeah, Eventscape was pretty cool. Um, they did a lot of uh, large-scale design for a lot of different companies. They had a lot of cool machinery. For example, they had like this five-axis robot. It's basically this, this giant arm that can construct a lot of things. And then they had a, a nice woodworking shop and they even um, they even just went back to the old-fashioned stuff and used like scissors and stuff too. Um, so it was nice to just 
have one like time to just like hang out, like just in general with like the wider group. And the wind came in, moved it, like swiped the plate out from underneath my burger. We did a lot of get together, so it's really nice to be able to like hang out with like other mill seniors. Like sometimes we'll just kind of like knock on people's doors and be like, hey, what's up? And then break into their home and bake things in their house. Everyone knows I love baseball. There's not a bigger baseball fan in the world, but even even I am not excited for this. <laughs> And that was the Mets game. I think we were all surprised on 4th of July when we uh, went outside and saw lines of food trucks and masses of people coming to Roosevelt Island and Cornell Tech to see the fireworks. More than anything to just move on. Whoa, I'm still hurting in my mind. Yeah, there are food trucks, there's spike ball. It was just like, it kind of reminded me of like the summer vibe that you get on the beach on California, but it was surprising ways on those of an island. Some of us were really bad at spike ball. I played some games with my friends. level with the fireworks with the Macy boats. We're right on the East River, so um, we got the best view. All in all, it was a fantastic evening. Uh, a fantastic fireworks display. It's probably the best one in July I've ever had. The most beautiful, the most specific fun feel. And um, I think the best part of it all is that we are with friends. Three, two, one. Thank you, Maya. Thank you, Angie. Thank you, Angie. Thank you to Michael Byrne. Thank you. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Dad. Can you say thank you to someone who's in this program? Thank you, Erwin, for introducing me to Kleptocrat. And thank you, Bill, for being a personal tutor. Thank you, Michael Byrne. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Thanks, Needy, for introducing me to assistive design and 3D printing.
Thanks, Oscar, for yeah. your beautiful hair and also for your social responsibility that you're teaching us. Thank you, Niti. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you, Michael Milstein. Thank you, Maya. <laughs> Thank you, Niti. I really liked your physical making class. Um, I learned a lot. We would like to thank the Michaels, Michael Bird and Michael Milstein. You just took both Michaels. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you, Needy. Thank you, Oscar and Bill. Thank you, Oscar. Thank you, Andy. Thank you, Eric, for being so nice and helping me with everything. Thank you, Stephen, for all the berry blasts at the cafe. Tiffany for the extra tofu. Thank you, Carly, for always opening the door for us and always getting us our packages. Thank you. Merci. Gracias. Danke. Grazie. Obrigado. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I will listen. One block. I will listen. That one block makes.